This is Dave Vickery, and you are watching AP Chemistry Exam Prep. This video will model the thought process and skills needed to be successful in AP Chemistry and pass the AP exam in the spring. This question covers big idea number four, which states that the rates of chemical reactions are determined by the details of the molecular collisions. Pause the video and read the question, then we'll discuss the solution. So big idea number four is kinetics in AP Chemistry. And kinetics, to really understand it, you have to understand the collisions between molecules. So anytime I have a reaction, the way things react is that they have to actually physically collide in a system. So if you think of two molecules, if we have, uh, this would be our calcium carbonate, and this is our ethanoic acid, we'll just call it, ET acid for now. These two items in a reaction have to collide. And there's a couple ways to increase the rate of that reaction. One would be to increase the number of um, molecules. So if we increase the number of calcium carbonates or we increase the number of ethanoic acids, we're going to get more collisions. Therefore, the rate of the reaction will increase. The other way is to increase. So Way number one, or method one, is increase the number of molecules. The second thing we can do is increase the speed of the molecule. So usually when you heat something up, that increases the energy and the speed of those molecules. And that will increase the frequency at which they interact. So if we can speed these up, they'll interact more times, therefore increasing the reaction. And that's basically it. So you have to really visualize at a molecular level, how can we do one of those two things? So let's read this, um, these solutions and see which one matches one of those. So I've got a little system over here. So if you think of it this way, if I've got this much solution, and these are my ethanoic acid molecules, if I decrease the volume, what is that going to do to the number of molecules of ethanoic acid? Well, it's going to decrease that number of molecules. So choice A does not do what we said it's going to do. So A is out. Choice B, decreasing the concentration of the ethanoic acid. So let me get rid of some of these uh, annotations here. If we decrease the concentration, so what does that mean? So if we have a concentration, we have a certain number of molecules in here. By decreasing it, we're actually decreasing that number of molecules. So that will not increase the rate of the reaction in any case. So choices A and B are already gone. Let me cross that off again decreasing the temperature at which the experiment is performed. Well, I told you that you have to increase the speed of the molecules themselves in order for the reaction to go faster because they're going to collide at a greater frequency. So decreasing the temperature actually slows those molecules down so you're not going to, that'll actually slow the experiment down. So choice C is out. So we already know by process of elimination that choice D is the answer, but let me explain why decreasing the particle size of calcium carbonate by grinding it into a powder increases the speed of the reaction. Get rid of a couple things here. If we think of calcium carbonate, it's, um, it's, it can come in this form where it looks, it's a mineral, it's, it's white, it kind of looks like a rock. Um, marble is considered calcium carbonate. But we have this certain surface area, and if I take my uh, red ethanoic acids and they're starting to react here on the surface of these rocks, you're going to get a reaction. It's just going to be a certain rate. If we were to increase the surface area by crushing or grinding, now we've got lots more places where the ethanoic acid can react. So there, and you think of these molecules, there's just billions and billions and trillions of them. 
they can react very quickly now with this powdered calcium carbonate and you're going to get um, in this case a lot of co2 generated from that reaction and that's how they measured rate in this original experiment was um, by the gas production so the fastest reaction here would be warm up the ethanoic acid or do this at a higher temperature um, use the highest concentration and use the greatest amount of surface area so powdered calcium carbonate so again to review choice d is the correct answer increasing the number of molecules and the speed of the molecules in any way will increase the rate of that chemical reaction and that's kinetics in a nutshell thanks for watching